guys, my name is Sediac and welcome back to another episode of Cabin Crew Simulator here on Roblox. But today, boys, we are about to do one of the hardest challenges in the whole entire game. And your boy is going to attempt it and I'm going to set myself a time and I want to see if you guys can beat me. Now, what is this challenge you may be thinking right now? Well, I'm about to tell you, but before I do, smash the like button down below if you are enjoying Cabin Crew Simulator. Subscribe if you want more Cabin Crew on the channel right now, and you'll get notified when more episodes do come out. But basically, boys, the challenge is, right, you have to complete every single disaster as quick as possible. Now, there is a total of five disasters in the game, and what we need to do is we need to create five flights and complete them all back to back. We're going to use multi-leg journeys uh, or multi-leg flights to do this, but it's going to be really, really difficult. Now, let's quickly see what we're kind of up against. If I just quickly create a flight, it doesn't really matter what it is. I just want to get to the disaster screen. Hold on, hold on. We have cabin fire, crash landing, depressurization, water landing, and unconscious pilots. We've got to complete all five of these as quick as possible. Now, before we do that, let me just quickly reset my character right now. Before we do that, we're going to make it as easy as possible, boys. We're going to try and make it as easy as possible right now so we can complete them as quick as possible. First thing that we're going to do right now is go and create a flight. We're going to pick the smallest plane in the game. Use Fool's Air. We're going to customize it and we need to make sure that we have the minimal amount of seats. Minimal passengers mean less people I've got to serve. Means quicker I can complete the flights. Which then means quicker the disasters happen. So seat layouts, we're going to do maximum leg room. So I can only have up to 10 passengers. I'm not sure if the chairs change anything. Um, 10. I'm not sure if I go for like the big boy chairs. Does it change anything with our seat layouts? It kind of sticks it to 10, which is fine. So we can have up to 10 passengers. Great, 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 great. Now, I need to change some of my settings on the actual game. So if I go to settings, I need to make sure that one, uh, we don't have any turbulence because that can slow down serving some of the passengers sometimes. We definitely want emergencies, no destructive passengers, no babies crying, so we're not going to see no babies flying, uh, no flying animations, uh, no weather particles, uneasy, uh, no lost pets, and um, they're fine. It's not really going to affect us at any point, but we need to make sure that we do have emergencies on. Now, we've got all that selected. We've got the smallest plane with the smallest amount of passengers. Now, technically, right, technically, boys, the... The kind of the the challenge doesn't begin yet. It begins when you've created the flight. So here we go. I want you all to do it with me right now and see how quick you can do it. So we're going to select the smallest plane. Select. I'm going to. There's five disasters. So you fly to New York, which is one. Back two. Back three, four, five. So that is one, two, three, four, five. You should see five arrows in creating a multi-leg flight. It doesn't really matter where you go, but uh, yeah, five flights now created. So we're going to select it, boys. I'm going to get rid of all of the food and drink options. So I've only got the first three to pick from. This will then really, really kind of reduce the amount of options I can serve to people, thus speeding up my process. All this stuff you gotta do, boys, in preparation right now to complete one of the hardest challenges in Cabin Crew Simulator. Every disaster at once. So select them all. Confirm. And it doesn't really matter what order you do them in. You select one now. When you land in the other place and the people get on the plane, you select the other one. So I reckon we're just gonna start at the top and work our way down. So cabin fire. And the challenge has now begun. Let's do this, boys. Let's do this right now. So, we're going to see how quick we can actually complete this. We're boarding from gate 8, which really helps me out because it is kind of... No, actually, it doesn't really help me out. It's still really, really far away. You're lucky if you get one of the close gates, like number 6 or 5 or something like that. So, gate 8 is just over here for your boy. How many passengers do we have on this flight right now? We have a total of 8. We could have had 10, but we've got 8, boys. We've got 8. Now, the great thing about Moilug Flight, this is the only time you're going to be waiting... When we get to our next destination, they'll all be there waiting for us. So start the boarding process right now. I want to make sure that there's nothing I need to do on the plane, like putting any of the food away. Because sometimes that can be a thing. Uh, like, i got to put these napkins away, boys. 
All right, put the napkins away, close the door, close the door there. And we're now just literally waiting for the passengers, the eight passengers, to get on board. Almost a minute has passed. Almost one minute has now passed, boys, but the last passenger is now getting on. We're going to close the door. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. And we are going to all the overhead lockers. There we go. Are they all done? I think so. I think so. Sit upright. Take off. Haven't got to do anything else because it means nothing. We're just trying to get these five disasters done as quick as possible. So we're not far off closing up on two minutes. Which is terrifying, boys. Which is terrifying to think that we've already nearly wasted two minutes. But it should get a little bit speedier now. Right, give crackers. Peanuts. Crackers. There we go. You take some more crackers. You take some more crackers as well. And then we do drinks. I'm not sure when the cabin fire happens. Because Oh, there we go. It happens now. Right, put the fire out. Put the fire out. Done, 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 done. I pull it out. The fire no longer exists. Come on. Come on. We're two minutes in. Right. Gotta pick up all the trash. So I suppose the cabin fire means that you don't have to pick up all the trash because you didn't serve all the passengers. If that makes sense, right? Right, come on. Let's do this. So preparing the camera for arrival. Seatbelt. Seatbelt. Oh, hello. Sit upright. Seatbelt and land. So this, boys, technically is the first disaster done, and we're approaching three minutes, okay? We're approaching three minutes, but your boy needs to speed up. Now, this is where it should get a lot faster. This is where it should get a lot faster, because technically, we have the new passengers already waiting. So as soon as this connects, I open up all the overhead lockers, then passengers get out, the new passengers get on. And then we got to select the next disaster as well. So, disaster one completed. Four more to go. Now, three minutes have completely passed in this challenge. Three minutes have completely passed. And I've only done one disaster. But, it, like I said, it should now speed up. Right, wait for all these to fall to get off. Uh, all the overhead lock... Oh, no, I'm missing the overhead locker. There we go. Done. Collect my monies. Very good, sir. Very good. And now we wait. Now we wait until we are told that we can choose the next disaster... And get the next set of passengers on board. And how many passengers do we have? So next is crash landing. We have, oh, only six passengers this time. This is amazing. This is amazing. Let's do it, boys. Let's do it. Even less passengers. That's like, I wonder what the lowest amount of passengers you can actually get on the plane would be. That would be quite interesting. That would be quite interesting. Right, technically four minutes have now passed. And I've only done one disaster. It's, it's. It's been snowing in New York, boys. But we're now heading on the way back to Roblox here. So put the napkins in. Close the door. And wait for that last passenger to sit down. There we go. Close the door. Hello, Overhead lockers. La -di -da, -di da Now I'm just going to keep doing what I've got to do. Until the message pops up. Sometimes you're quicker than when the message pops up. But we're doing it, boys. Next is the crash landing. Now, the only issue with these, this next one is there's a bit more to it. Granted, you only got to serve half the cabin. But the downside is there's a big animation until the disaster is complete. And there's a lot of stuff you've got to do. Not like the cabin fire where it just appears, you put it out, and then you continue. So, yeah. Right, cafe, cafe. Doubling up on the coffees, boys. Oh, excuse me. Take the Coca-Cola. Why, why are you doing this to me right now, fools? Right, enjoy the peanuts. Uh, oh, there we go, there we go, there we go. The plane's going down. The plane's going down. Right, everybody needs to get in the brace position. Everyone needs to get in the brace position. Five minutes have passed, boys. Five minutes have passed. Right, brace full. Brace, 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 land. Right, five minutes have passed in this challenge already, and I haven't even completed the second one. What? Right, come on. Come on, boys. We're now bracing. We don't get to see anything because all animations are turned off. Well, I'll open up the doors. I open up the doors. Is everybody getting off? There's no doors at the back, is there? No. Get off, you fools! Down the slide! Fools there's about to go oof. Any minute now. Any minute now. Uh, plane, everybody's off, by the way. 
There you go. You can now kaboom. You can now kaboom. So, second one now complete. We've got three more to go. And we're just about to cross, right, the six-minute mark. We're just about to cross the six-minute mark right now. And I've only done two. So, I'm pretty much averaging one every three minutes. <sighs> right, let's go, boys. Collect. Now we're going to do depressurization. And we're going back to gate eight. That's where we were originally. Now, I've got to run all the way over there, which, you know, is what it is. Nothing much you can kind of do about that right now. But they're already there. The plane should really be ready to open. The pilots are here with me. And there looks to be two, four, six, seven, eight more passengers, right? Yes, there's eight passengers. So open up the door. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Start the boarding. There's eight passengers. And obviously, we need to take care of the food, if anything, or, you know, napkins, anything appears over here. So, just a few more passengers. There's the napkin right now, boys. Put the napkin away. Close the door. Close this door. And we just wait for these passengers to get on board. So, this is the depressurization. Again, an easy one that doesn't require me resetting my character. So, when we get back with the plane, they'll be at the gate. What, what's going on here? Oh, did I not put the napkins Hello, in? Oh, what a fool. This is your what a fool. Right, there we go. We're expecting a smooth there we go. Sit upright. Come on. Seatbelt. Sit upright. Seatbelt. What's going on with these overhead lockers? Boys? What's up with those overhead lockers? We had a visual glitch there. And I'm kind of confused. And I'm kind of confused. But we're up to eight minutes almost. I feel like this has been the slowest one because we've had to run all the way back. I think the ones where the plane gets destroyed are a little bit longer than three minutes on average. Them overhead lockers are open. Right, so let's get into it, boys. Let's get into the group. Water, water. Uh, Coca Cola. Coca Cola. We've got a Coca Cola. And we. Oh, oh. Depressurization, boys. Put your oxygen mask on. We have experienced a cabin depressurization. Flight attendants, make sure all right, done. Have their Nailed it. On. Oh, no, you, you wait, where's yours? Oh, no, we're done, we're done, we're done, we're done. I'm getting kind of nervous. I'm getting kind this of nervous, boys. Come on! Hurry up! Right, time to pick up the trash. Now, I'd like the cabin fire. You haven't got to pick up all the trash because you didn't serve all the passengers. So you're only really picking up what you served. It's weird that the overhead lockers are still there. Hmm. Right. Tray table. There we go. Um, tray table, even though we can't see it. So it's a good job we've got the icons. And land. And land, baby! So we're now technically... Um, is it nine? Nine minutes in? And we've just completed this one. We're still working on an average of three minutes in emergency. But this one should save us a little bit, a little bit of time for what we lost on the last one. So, we're now here, we're waiting for the jetway to connect, and our passengers are already sitting there. By the looks of it, there is one, two, there's, by the looks of it, there's only four. I could be wrong there. I could legit be wrong. But it looks like there's four passengers. Right, hold on. Open the door. Hold the overhead lockers. What's crazy is because of this visual glitch, I can't see what's going down, but there we go. We know what we're doing. Right, let's run out, boys. Let's run out. Three completed. We now move on to our last two. And we have... Well, we don't... Oh, no, there's more passengers over there. So, four, five, six, seven, another eight passengers. So, get ready to accept the next disaster, which will be a water landing. And there is eight passengers. So, get these fools boarded right now. Let's go, boys. Let's go. It's time to rock and roll right now. It's time to rock and roll. And we're just going to wait to see if there's... Yep, there's a napkin we got to put on. It always seems to be napkins, doesn't it, boys? It always seems to be napkins. That's now done. There's still a kind of slight visual glitch, but, you know, it will be okay. So where are we up to right now? We're literally... We've crossed over the... Te we're ten and a half minutes into this, boys. We are ten and a half minutes into this. Hopefully the goal would be to do it under 15 minutes, but I don't know if that's going to be a thing or not. 
I honestly don't know. So come Captain on, close the door. Welcome aboard the flight. We're all the overhead lockers. Today, so the seat sign off. Right, I think I've done them all. Thanks for flying with us. And Who once again, needs a seatbelt on? Right, there we go. Depart. Let's go. So I've actually off. broken the plane. I've legit broken the plane right now, and it's hilarious. I actually can't remember what this next disaster is. I've forgotten what I've done so far, and I've forgotten what's next. So it might be a surprise for your boy. Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola, Coca-Cola. Water. Oh, double Cokes, boys. Double oh, no, I missed the double Cokes there. Nope, got him. Got him. Oh, so what is it? This is your captain speaking. We are going to water landing. Of course it is. Of course it is. Of course it is. Of course it is. Now the only downside is it's another time-consuming disaster, not like the depressurization or the cabin fire, which can be over in seconds. We've got to go for a full process. So it says brace, brace, brace. Are we good? Are we good? We've landed. Open up the door. Open up the door. The plane is and we're now evacuating, boys. Make sure all we are now evacuating. Get on a life raft before you leave oh, hang on. I've got to make sure that they actually get out. Evacuate, fools. Right, there we go. I almost missed that bit then, boys. I almost missed that bit right there. So we're now officially on 12 minutes. There is definitely room right now for us to complete the next one. Oh, but it's, un it's unconscious pilots. That's also a very, very time-consuming one as well. Right, send us back, boys. Send us back. Let's get this completed. And because the plane's been oofed, we have to now respawn ourselves from um, the the kind of the, the beginning of the airport, which is not a problem. Unconscious pilots right now, this is our last one officially. This is our, officially our last one. We have to run all the way back, but at least we're at gate seven, which is a gate closer, but it makes no difference because it's still in the same corner. I know, I know boys, the plane is legit here. So run you fool. Are these people part of my plane? Two, four, six, seven, eight. Oh, is that nine? Is that nine people? It is nine people. Ah, oh, just when you thought your boy was going good. Hello, his. How you doing, boy? Jump with me now. Jump with me right now. Jump with me, you fool. Right, I gotta go, his. I will see you soon. You take care. I I'm walking to a door. I got a challenge to complete right now. I got a challenge to complete right now. Right, so pick up the nap. Oh, we got we got two sets of napkins. We do. We got two sets of uh, sets of napkins, boys. Right, is that the last passengers? Here's the last passenger right now. Why well, you're so late? Get out the plane, you fool! You're so late, boy. You're so late. Right. Get ready to shut the door. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This Close everything. All the overhead lockers. Everything is all broken. And there's one person over here. And take off. So it's unconscious pilots. I think we have to serve everything. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. But we're almost about to be 14 minutes deep into this right now. I don't think we're going to complete this in 15 minutes, boys. I don't think we're going to complete this in 15 minutes. Right, crackers. Chips. Uh, take the chips, boy! Right, crackers. And peanuts. So this is where I kind of falling short slightly is the fact that they all want different things and if you're lucky enough to get like multiple flights with minimal passengers you're winning. Right, that's everything done, right? Yeah. So this come on. Come on. Deck. We have started our initial descent and we'll be landing soon. Thanks for flying with us, and we hope to see you again soon. So, the when does the disaster actually trigger on this? I did select unconscious pilots, right? There we go! I forgot you gotta do the trash. Right, let's do the window first. No, actually, let me do the pilot. Right. There we go. And then I'll do the window. Because you gotta wait for the message to come through. And then we got to land the plane. So we're now officially 15 minutes into this. We didn't do it in 15 minutes, boys. We didn't do it in 15 minutes, but can we do it in less than 16 minutes? Nah, it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. I'm waiting to sit down. We sat down. We're going to fly the plane. We're going to try and fly the plane right now. Right, come on. Easy, boys. Easy right now. We'll see what kind of um, 
This is the I think this is the most time consuming one. Because there's a lot going on to it, isn't there? Right, let's bring the plane down. Ooh. Centerline accuracy is important. Ooh. And up. Is that smooth operator? That was the most butter landing you've ever seen in your life. Let me know in the comment section right now. Was that the most butter landing you've ever seen in your life? And I did that, boys. I did that right now. Yeah. Yeah. Right, we're 16 minutes into this. We're over 16 minutes right now. Hasn't really worked out too well. If that's not the perfect landing, I don't know what is. I don't know what is. And the rating is... Duh, 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 duh. Oh, 72. Landing smooth as though was really good. Touchdown was absolutely terrible. Skip taxi. We'll get these fools out of here right now. And by the looks of it, we're going to complete it in 17 minutes. Right. Boom, 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 boom. And we are now done. I've got the time. It was actually 16 minutes 50. 16 minutes 50 seconds. Can you beat me? 15 minutes, 60, uh, 15, 16, 16 minutes, 50 seconds, boys. 16 minutes and 50 seconds. Can you beat me? One of the most difficult challenges in Cabri Crew is trying to be the fastest person to complete all five disasters. Ooh, that was difficult. If you enjoyed it, smash a like button down below. But until next time, I see you all soon. So, goodbye.